G'day, mate. Today's episode, let's J, we go exploring. I also, well, that was a terrible Australian accent. It's, it's much better than normally when I'm not recording, I promise. No, in uh, today's episode, basically, we're, see, the splash screen right here says 1.2.4. So don't worry, by the end of the episode, we will have updated to 1.2.4. But, uh, in the episode, in my last episode, I believe I was in 1.1. And then I updated to 1.2.3, and now we're in 1.2.4 because that's how long it took for me to get this video up. Um, it, I know I'm late. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. But um, yeah, we go exploring. We go find a jungle, and we go to the Nether for the first time. That not on peaceful. And and I meet lots of friendly ghasts. Lots of them. They're so friendly. Alright, let's get started. I have not done anything since we last uh, saw, saw one another. I'm right here in the ruins of my house. So I'm actually in the mood to do two things. First, let me check I'm on. Oh. I did that for creative mode just because I'll scream around at the villagers and whatnot. Um, I'm in a mood to find a village. I don't know if I can find a jungle biome this, but. Um, I'm going to try to find a village so I could uh, see the new iron golems in action and that sort of stuff. So yes, let's go exploring. Also, let's kill some pigs. Die, pigs! Die! Um, it is 2 a.m. for me. So, excuse me if I sound a little bit, a little bit tired. It's just I actually had an upset stomach earlier and I can't sleep. So, these pigs are dry! So I figured um, I'll watch a little bit of B O and wanted to play some Minecraft. So here I am playing Minecraft. That's, that looks kind of cool over there, that square looking thing in the center of my screen. Ooh, I didn't bring along any... Oh, I have sticks. Like, some sticks. I did not bring along very good adventuring inventory. Not very good at all. Who brings along lapis when they go uh, exploring? But yes. Oh, zombie. Hi, zombie. Spinning zombie. Spinning zombie. Come on. Come at me, bro. Come at me. Experience. Yay. But yes. That looks cool. I'm wondering what's over here. Oh, it's a ravine. That's neat. Did I bring along? Oh, ooh, I went out. Let me out. Let me out. Did I bring along any wool? I did, so I can make a bed if I needed to. All right, good. I'm smart. Well, yeah, I'm at least I'm a little bit. I'm a little bit smart. But yes, I wonder if I've even. Um, I don't see any chunk uh, errors. I think I'm generating new chunks. Let's see here, there's. Yeah, I am. I see a tree generate. Um. So that's weird. I wonder if I'm uh, actually using the new... I don't know how that works. I know, like, the Minecraft server, they have a, a nice... Uh, they have a jungle biome right off the bat. I don't know if, was, if they just... Huh. That's weird. I don't know how, the, um, how the, they handle rendering chunks and new uh, updates. I know it used to be a bunch of chunk, uh, gigantic chunk errors for boundaries, but I don't know if they still do that or not. But you can see, we are indeed. Also, my uh, some running fraps, my little screen thing, which you're pointing at it. I don't, you can't see that. In the bottom left, you can see my uh, kind of whatchamajigger progress thing. It's kind of off charts, but um, yeah. A nice forest biome up here. I have no idea where I am. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna bring you guys, I don't think this is gonna be that terribly interesting, just me walking, don't even know what direction I'm walking, west. Ooh, I'm getting hungry. Um, me walking west until I can't walk west no more. Oh, a squid, I needed a squid earlier. Die, squid. I went hunting for a squid and I could not find any squid. More squid. I need to die some sheep. Um, so yes, I'm going to bring you guys back in, after I kill these squid, and um, when things get interesting again. 
Well, hello, hello. I guess this answers my question. You know what kind of biome this is? It's a forest biome. So I am getting the new 1.2 world generation, the 1.1. Or uh, world made 1.1. And look, there's even a ravine. Oh, I thought it was a chunk here at first, but nope, it's just a ravine. Alright, still looking for a village. It's nice to know this is here. Here's the coordinates. Um, can't see it. X308, Z816, negative 816. So yeah, good to know it's here. Alright, I'm going to, because I'm getting very low frame rate, I'm going to stop recording right here and bring you guys back in when I find something else cool. Why do I get the feeling these trees are going to catch on fire very, very soon? Well, this jungle biome was absolutely huge, and what time is it? I don't know what time it is. It's, it's huge, like literally hundreds of blocks, like at least 300-ish blocks in one direction. I have no idea how far it goes in either direction over here. But uh, now we have an ocean biome, a nice big flat ocean of infinite oceanness. So yes, I'm um, still looking for a village, and I'll let you know if I find anything cool. Also, uh, I've noticed some of the, you know, the tall grass, like uh, this right here? That. I've noticed that growing on leaves in here, which is kind of interesting. But yes, I'll bring you guys back in again later. Alright, this is, uh, that's not natural. So I think we've managed to, uh, to successfully circle completely around. And indeed, we did. Wow, we were almost right on target. This is just pure luck. I was just kept walking in one direction and uh, just randomly managed to help to find this. So yes, um, the mission... Oh, here's our spawn point where we fell down like ten times. Um, our mission to find a village was a complete and utter failure. But we did find a uh, jungle biome, which is always a plus because we were not trying to find a jungle biome and look we even made a home right as the sun is setting but um yeah i'm probably going to start a branch mine pretty soon in here and i'm i might just uh, render the map in cartograph g if that um which is a map rendering software or i brought along some reeds so i was going to uh plant those and make a start a reed farm so i can make an actual minecraft map but, um, I was thinking about putting it said Cartograph G and just uh, looking for a village. But I don't know yet. So, um, if I do that, and it might be a little bit cheating, but at the same time, I want to find a village so I can try out all this new stuff. And, uh, well, not really new, but I want to. Oh, this is weird. This is a weird, uh, interesting. We, um,. I want to find a village of... Oh, that is weird. Or, um, I just want to find a village just to uh, start helping out the villagers, because I think that might be in um, coming updates they're going to focus more on, like, helping out villagers. And did I just place a torch? I think I did. But, um, oops, that was not the button I want to press. I want to press the... Oh, there's a torch I placed. But, yes, um, I'm going to figure out what I'm going to do, and I think it's probably going to be boring, because I'm probably going to be farming. So uh, I'll bring you back, you guys back in when I, uh, when interesting things happen, as usual. All right, guys. I was just doing some branch mining, and uh, I'm going to create a map because I also went and got some reeds. I got some redstone. I made a compass. But uh, something else interesting I found while I was branch mining: eight diamonds in one vein of diamonds. So. Uh, that's a nice find, to say the least. Just sitting there, being boring and placing cobblestone bricks in my house. Um, so yes, I'm gonna make, I'm gonna find a place to go uh, and uh, create a map first. Uh, but then I think it's all the way around. Yes. This is so that way we don't get lost next time. Uh, next time we go exploring. But we're also going to create an enchantment table, which I believe is one, two, th oops, that's not how you do it. One, two, three, four, oops, ah, I can't place. One of the, oh, we need a book, that's right. Do, do, do. We, alright. 
so we need to make a book. That's not here. That's not how you make a book. Ah, book. Now we make an enchantment table. Doot, doot, and then a book. All right, enchantment table. Achievement get enchanter. All right. So, uh, where should we put this? We should have a spe uh, special room for it, I think. Eh, right now we don't have any room at all. So, oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, we're gonna make some bookshelves now, so we can get all 14 of our levels in there, hopefully. And uh, pretty soon we're also gonna go to the Nether, because I'm starving for glowstone. I want some glowstone. I want it now. It looks like we can make two bookshelves. So let's do so. Uh, I don't think this will get us very high. Hey, achievement! Get librarian! So, um. That's, I don't have an axe. Uh, I need to make an axe. Make some sticks. Dude. I have never enchanted before, ever, so this is new to me. This is going to be an interesting... Oh, I don't even need... I thought you couldn't get the uh, bookshelf back if you use an axe, but I guess you'll get... I guess you only get the books. Alright. Uh, now let's go and... I think you need one space of air between the two things. Alright. Um, what should we enchant? I don't want to enchant this diamond pick yet, but, uh, hmm. Thinking maybe we can get what's not beat up, or what's beat up the least. Um, actually, we're going to craft an iron chest plate. And I think even the low level enchantments. Actually, you know what, I'm going to go look up some enchantments in the Minecraft wiki and uh, find out exactly what the stuff is, what's the best course of action. So, I looked up on, uh, stuff on the Minecraft wiki and I have no idea how things work still. So, um, I do think the best course of action is to either enchant my diamond pick, because I've almost not used it at all, or, see how high of an enchantment can we get here? Um, stick. Oh, there we go. Uh, if you write, if you put something, in, uh, if you do something like the stick right here, because the stick can't be enchanted, if you right click, it'll cycle through it without you having to pick stuff up. So uh, it looks like the highest we can go is level eight. So I'm gonna try a level eight enchantment on this. Let's see what happens. Oops. Not fast. Alright, so what do we get? Efficiency 2. That's actually not bad. Not bad at all. I can deal with that. I can deal with that. So, let's, uh, let's try that out. I'm going to show you off where I found it. Go down here. All the way down. Yes, the torches are not even, I know. The torches are all over the place. I just need the light in here, so. Didn't really care too terribly much about where the torches were, just as long as there was torches. Oh, wow. I was hoping for silk touch. But uh, I don't think I'm going to get silk touch at that level. Oops. But um, this actually is nice. This rather nice. I'm, I'm happy with that. So yes. Alright, now I'm off to do some more strip mining. Yay! I'm actually going to do one more enchantment, because I still have some levels. I'm going to enchant this bow. With, uh, I have six levels, so I'm going to try to get level six enchantment if I can. Up one, I passed it. Ah, uh, there it is. Alright. Power one. Again, not bad. Alright, now I'll go back to strip mining. One, I found a chunk here. I was just going back to get some uh, saplings so we could eventually uh, get some uh, gigantic trees near the house and I found a chunk here. Also, I found a floating island with a tree on it. 
I would like to live there. But yes, we are here on the map. So I'm going to go and get home, and I will see you guys later. Hello again. It's been a while since I last uh, talked to you guys in my time. Um, as you can see, things are a little bit different. This is my strip mine. Uh, above me, you hear sheeps. That's because there are sheeps above me. Uh, it's a sheep farm thing with jigger. Um, so yes, it's been about two weeks since I last saw you guys, and I need to make a pick. Um, it, it's been about two weeks. I've just been kind of working down here, working on the main house stuff, things of Doom. And um, yeah, 1.2.4 is now out. And yeah. So I'm just, uh, I'm bringing you guys back in right now because I wanted to do something. I don't know why I did that. Um, because I wanted to go to the nether. And I figured I've, n I've never been to the nether outside of Peaceful. And so I, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm a bit scared, guys. I'm scared. I'm scared. Um, I'm gonna go check some, ch uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go check to make sure that stuff, actually, wait, how many arrows do I, I need more arrows. Alright, so I'm gonna go, uh, make some more arrows if I can, and I'll bring you, bring you guys back in when we're ready to go. Okay, never mind, um, I only had one feather, so, cause zombies don't drop feathers anymore. But, um, yeah, so we're gonna go light this up. I'm scared, guys. I'm scared. I'm scared. Wish me luck. Uh, uh, ooh, what's going on? What's going on? Lagginess. Let's go, God Guest. Already. Oh, I hit it. Come at me, bro. Come at me. Uh. Come at me, bro. I know. Oh, God. Oh, God. This is probably terrible commentary, but um, I'm, I'm just freaking out because, again, I've only ever been here on Peaceful, and ghasts I'm not used to dealing with. They always seem so much easier to fight in everyone else's videos. And by easier, I mean they were terrible. Okay, just get some of some form of defenses up. I totally meant to t place that cobblestone there, definitely. You know me. Not freaking out at all, guys. Not freaking out at all. Nope. Calm under pressure. Calm under pressure. Oh, damn it. That's why we brought along all this cobble. Okay, alright. What's going on? Something. I heard some. I heard, thought I heard it die. Nope, he's still out there. He's still out there. Okay. Um, also, let's try not to get lost if we can. Um, there was, really, what we came out here for is glowstone. I have some stuff I will work on, some things I need to make, but I need glowstone for them. And also, that's my main thing for you guys. Where's that gas? I'm scared. I'm scared. Oh, I don't want to die. I don't want to die, guys. I'm scared of gas. Oh, uh-oh. That was a dumb idea. So yes, uh, 1.2.4 is now out, and I'm making a video for you guys now, because I realize it's been a long time since I made you guys a video, or since I last recorded, because I don't think I had enough episode before this to make an episode. But, um, oh, I probably should place the torch. So yes, there's some nice glowstone up there, I'm going to go get it. It's been a while since I played Minecraft. Actually, I've been. Uh, I'm working on a uh, on a map, a race for the wool map, or capture the wool. Actually, it's capture the record. 
thing. And I, I, I used to make a lot of maps for Team Fortress 2. Uh, you, some of you guys that watch my older videos may see some, uh, some old Team Fortress 2 gameplay I put up that no one liked at the time. Um, so, um, yeah, I, I was used to making maps for Team Fortress 2, and it's been a while since I made a Team Fortress 2 map as well, but, um, oops, I don't need that. So, really, uh, I decided to try my hand at a Race for the Wool map, and I had an idea to make classes. Basically, I have different chests with different loadouts, different stuff in them, so that, uh, we can have different classes, Minecraft, uh, like, uh, sort of like, uh, how there's different Team Fortress 2 classes. And each, each t class is the task of defending their jukebox, jukebox records. I cannot talk right now. Um, e each class, it's like, uh, we have a, um, a soldier, not really a soldier, I forget what I called it. I think I called it tank. Yeah, I called it tank. We have a tank class, which is tasked with, um, with kind of, uh, oops, uh, Wee, I like that noise. I'm all discombobulated. It's been a while since I last. Oh, oh almost two stacks. Actually, it's been a while since I last made a video. But uh, we have the tank class, which is kind of like your standard. He has good armor, uh, iron armor, diamond tools, well, diamond sword, uh, but no. Uh, he has, like, golden tools. So he's made mostly to try to kill things and not um, mine. Then we have a scout, who's pretty much the opposite. He's not designed to attack things. He has potions of speed, and um, uh, he's supposed to go out and uh, basically uh, go into dangerous areas. He's the most expendable. He has uh, leather armor, so not that good armor. Uh, but he uh, has potions of swiftness, again, and... Uh, Forget what I think he has a stone sword and then diamond tools, and then we have the guardian, who's supposed to be like a redstone dude. Uh, he lays traps around the base, like around where the records are. So he goes to where the records are and, and basically traps them, and uh, like will put fire charge. Oh god! Uh, uh oh, not good. Come on, come at me, bro. Come at me. Ha! Ah, ah, ha! Ah. Ha! There's another one out there. But, um, he basically lays the, uh, traps around the jukebox. Uh-oh. Uh Uh-oh. Where is it? Where is it? Oh, that was retarded. That was a waste of an arrow. Um. Ah! I'm so good at this game, guys. So good at this game. Um. Should have brought more blocks with me. Oh well. Um, so that distracted me. Oh, the guardian basically, yeah, red defensive redstone. Then we have the specialist who is uh, offensive redstone. He's designed to do uh, cannons, essentially. Things like cannons. He's also in charge of potion making. Oh, well, the guardian's in charge of farming. I know. So so uh, so entertaining to be the farmer. But, yeah, I, I think it's going to turn out well. I might make some videos about uh, about the making of the map. I might, like, uh, record myself designing things. I was using a lot of sandstone architecture in the uh, in the map, so that's why I'm happy to see that we have new sandstone blocks in 1.2.4. Uh, and you've probably seen, like, 20 different videos already on them if you're watching my videos, so I'm not going to bother you if, like, ooh, we have new wood. I'm pretty sure you, you already know about the new wood we have. That's dumb. So let's dig out from underneath our feet. Alright, there we go. This is a good haul of glowstone. Um, another thing we might need to do is look for another fortress. Rather, uh... Here. Ooh, spooky cave noises. So, that's what we're going to go do right now. Let's go on the lookout for... Whoa. 
Whoa! Okay, we're gonna go. Hey, zombie pig man, come on! You want you want to go down there? No, 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 no! He's silly. No, no, you like the, you like holes, don't you? You like lava. I don't want to fall on it. I do not want to fall on it. I mean, I only have this enchanted bow. Really, is the only thing that. Um, well, all my and all the glowstone. Come on, you you like holes, don't you? You like holes. I'm sure you do. Yeah, bye bye. Oh, that was entertaining. Um, another thing is I might start uploading different videos on my channel. I love the game uh, Star Wars Empire at War. I don't know if you've ever heard of it. It's uh, basically it's a real-time strategy game, and um, I love it. I mean, it's like I love the mods for it mostly. I don't actually. The vanilla game by itself isn't that great, but they they add so many new ships and heroes and whatnot. So uh, I've actually uh, I've made my own mods. I've taken uh, other people's mod mods and added my own stuff to them. Made the uh, AI hyper aggressive because the AI by by themselves, in my opinion, isn't the most aggressive AI in the world. Come on, come on. Come on. Ow. Ah! Ah, I'm on fire. I'm on fire. Ah! Ah! I'm in a bad spot. Ah, run away, run away, run away! Okay, alright, alright. Alright, alright. We got this. We got this still. We still got this. Ah! Got one of them. Okay, where's the other one? We're still regenerating health, that's good, that's good. Oh, there he is. Out of arrows. Uh, hey, 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 that was... That was a lot of crap. Ha! Ah! Come here, experienced balls. I want your wind chimes. Ow. Hey, a gas tier. And some gunpowder. I didn't know they dropped the gunpowder. Um. But, yes, anyway, what was I saying? Oh, uh, Empire at War. Yeah, so I'm probably going to start recording uh, videos of that right after this. And uh, another game I've been playing recently is Mass Effect. I've never played Mass Effect. Uh, probably because it's a story game, I, I, I'm probably not going to upload videos of it. Because I don't want to spoil the story. Well, I guess if you're watching a Let's Play, you, you don't mind having the story spoiled. But still, I, I'd rather not um, do story games. Portal didn't go over that well. And so I, I'd just rather... I don't see any nether fortresses anywhere. I, I, I'd rather stick with just uh, do-your-own-thing games, if that makes any sense. So I won't be doing the story of Empire at War, I'll just be doing a, like a Galactic Conquest match or something. Where we try to take over the galaxy! So yes, that's what's been happening on my end. Um, I've also, one reason why I haven't been uploading as much is because of life stuff. I've been really busy because I'm in, I'm in college and uh, I took too many classes I think. Because I'm always super duper busy, and also I probably should. Uh, I have work I need to do for my work, my job. I'm a journalist, uh, not not like a super like oh my god a journalist. No, it's I, I say I'm a journalist because it makes me sound cooler. Or, um, basically, uh, I ba I wa I go to little league football games, and I watch them for my, one of my old teachers, and I make like uh, sports editorials for them. It's my job. I get paid ten bucks an hour for it. I mean, it's it's not bad not bad. I, I don't normally like football. I don't watch any sports at all. I mean, I've been to a couple uh, Angels game for baseball. I've been to like a Dodgers game and an Angels game. I live in California, so they're both nearby. And, um, but I've never really been a guy that's into sports. I've always just like, ah, sports, yay. So, yeah, I did not know anything about football when I started the job, but now... Now I know a little bit about football, just a tad, and it's enough to get me by. So I basically sit there, and uh, every Friday, 
I go and I watch games and I take notes on the games and uh, then I write articles about it and then I have a day to write the article and today is my day to write the article but I'm lazy I'll probably do it later tonight like at midnight or something like that so yes um how have you guys been doing you can't answer that but uh all right, it's always polite to ask it's always polite to ask um I've also let's pick some almost out no I'm actually I'm just gonna return to my I'm gonna return to the base So, yes, I will see you guys, assuming there's no sudden gas attacks. Oh, I hear a gas. Um, so let's say that, I hear gas. Um, assuming there's nothing that goes terribly, terribly, terribly wrong, I will meet you guys back at the base. And actually, you know what? No, I think this is enough uh, video for an episode. I will actually see you guys next time, uh, assuming I don't die. Uh, I will return to the base, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good day. I just heard a ghast. I'm so close. I just heard a ghast. I'm scared, guys. I have to cross this. Oh, where is it? Where? Where is he? Oh, there he is. Oh, no. wait, what? Where is he? Where is he, guys? Help me. Where? What? I'm scared. I'm scared. Uh, must build bridge. Suspense. Suspense. I know. After episode suspense. Oh. Oh God. Oh, there you are. Oh, I'm out of arrows. Get down here. Get down here, boo. Coward. Ow. Uh, I know. This is the best commentary ever. I'm staying still. Why can't you hit me? Come on. You're terrible at this. Come on. I'm also terrible at this. Ow. Ow. Oh. Come on. Gas hitboxes are bullshit. Just saying. Oh, that one just spawned. Oh, and a magma cube. Oh, God. Everything's going wrong, guys. Everything's going wrong. Ah, uh, it's like a... It's like I'm doing a Vex map or something. Ah. Uh, ah. Come back here. back here. Boom. Yeah, I know. I'm not scared because there aren't any creepers about. Come on. Oh, whoa. I'm not, I'm not healing. It's such a good time to be eating. Okay. Uh, where'd they go? Where'd they go? Oh, there's one. Where'd the other one go? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Wow, this this place went to hell. Ah, I made a joke because it's another. It went to hell. Ah, uh, I'm fine. Down from the ceiling. Ah, I gotcha. That makes me happy.
Anyway, um, yeah. Uh, assuming that I think the other gas might have despawned. If he did, then which I yeah, I think he did. All right, so um, heck, we're almost there. I'll I'll actually I'll extend the episode a little bit more because I'm nice like that. Just in case anything else goes terribly terribly wrong. Because I don't want to say goodbye to you guys yet. I miss you. It's been a while. This episode's late. I probably I just realized there's no couple right there. Actually, I'm gonna build. Magma cube. Come on. Actually, you know, I'm gonna kill you too. Because you, you remind me of slimes. I like slimes. You also remind me of slinkies. Come on. Ah. Ow. Yay! Experience! I got two levels. That makes me happy. I'm so happy. Alright. Uh, now let's go back to the base. Yay! Home sweet cave. Not really a cave. I made all this by hand, so it's not really a cave. But, um, yeah, still kind of ugly. It's snowing outside. But, yeah. It's good to be back. Uh, up here is actually uh, this mess. It's actually a piston clock. And what it does is it kind of makes this happen. We this is what this is what took me so long to work on, and it's is a is random not really random but it's timed so that this will shut off in a few minutes once the water flows. There it goes. And it does it like all the way down to the cave. That water just flows everywhere. Um, not finished yet. It's not pretty yet. It's actually really ugly right now. Uh, I've also gotten this hooked up. And same thing over here. They match this. I know, I, I put this out there. It's like, oh yeah, creeper defense. Now they can't break down my wooden doors. Except they can just walk on the pressure plate. So I'm smart like that. Yay. Um, so yeah. Uh, probably should show you show you what happened to the map. Um, I told you guys I'd bring you get back in when I found a village. Um, let, let me show you the map. And you'll see. Uh, yeah, I kind of, uh, finished the map without you, and there are no villages on the entire thing. No, nothing. Like, up at, at the top, um, top left, there's, the, is where the sandstone quarry is. Top right, there's a jungle. Bottom, uh, uh bottom right, there's a jungle. Bottom left, there's a jungle. And even further up past the sandstone area, there is a jungle. There are jungles everywhere on this thing. So I thought I was like, well, oh, I found a jungle. But then I found so many jungles that like this. Like, oh, never mind. It wasn't... I, I don't... Yeah, it makes me sad. So, yes. Anyway, now I think this is a good place to end the episode. So I will put this away. And I will see you guys next time.